perforated. The word perforated is an adjective that is commonly used to describe something that has small holes or perforations in it. These holes are typically evenly spaced and are made intentionally for various purposes. The term perforated is derived from the Latin word perforare, which means to pierce through. Here are some examples of how perforated can be used in different contexts. 1. Paper. Perforated paper is commonly used for tear-off slips, such as tickets or coupons. These perforations allow for easy separation without the need for scissors or tearing the paper unevenly. For instance, I tore off a coupon from the perforated sheet of paper. 2. Metal. Perforated metal sheets are often used in construction, architecture, and industrial applications. These sheets have tiny holes punched or drilled into them, allowing for airflow, visibility, or decorative purposes. For example, the perforated metal panel on the fence allows the wind to pass through. 3. Packaging. Some food or beverage packaging, like cans or plastic containers, have small perforations that serve as easy open features. These perforations allow consumers to open the packaging without using a knife or scissors. For instance, the perforated tab on the milk carton made it easy to open. 4. Stamps. Postage stamps often have perforated edges to facilitate easy separation. These perforations make it simple to tear off individual stamps from a sheet or a roll. For example, I carefully tore the stamp along the perforated edges. 5. Leather. Perforated leather is often used in furniture, car seats, or clothing to provide ventilation or a decorative pattern. The small holes in the leather allow air to circulate, making it more comfortable to sit or wear. For instance, the perforated leather seats in the car kept us cool during the hot summer. In summary, perforated describes something that has small, evenly spaced holes or perforations. These holes can serve various purposes, such as tear-off features, ventilation, or decorative patterns.